So, Caitlin, how are you feeling about getting shots today? Fine! All right, bud. Okay. Look how much bigger they are now. I know. Can they breathe? I don't know if they have lungs. We'll have to look that up. But I'm guessing they breathe. They're so big. They have... Oh, be soft with it. These are living animals. No, they're not. They are. These are caterpillars. They're going to turn into butterflies. Yeah, and then they're going to fly around. Then, then we're going to put flowers in there. Did you get my hat? She's a gangster. Are you a pirate? <laughs> She's coming. She's gonna get you. She's gonna get you. <laughs> oh! <laughs> you okay? Yeah. Laura, stop beating everybody up. <laughs> so we all try to do our chores. And Laura tries to harass. Janae attracts a crowd every time. So I'm working with our wireless router right now because we haven't had internet all morning and you never realize how much you use the internet until it's not working and it's super frustrating. And so I'm trying to figure it out right now. <sighs> oh good, it's working. Yes. Classic blow on the machine. Turn it off, turn it on. Works every time. It's your kindergarten doctor's visit. How you feeling about it? Good. <laughs> Why are you smiling? Because I want to get the shot. Okay, Caleb, they want you to put this gown on. Why do I need it? It makes it easier for them to examine you. Caitlin, how are you feeling about getting shots today? Fun! <laughs> so why do you think it would be fun? I get ice cream and toys. Okay, well we'll focus on those things. You know, you've had a lot of things happen to you that I think hurt a lot worse than getting a shot. Shots are just like a little pinch, not too hard of a pinch. You're gonna do great. Yeah. So our pediatrician has a rule that if you're 10 minutes late getting here, that you miss the appointment, but you have to pay for it. And I thought for sure we were gonna be late. But somehow we hit every green light on the way here. It was a miracle. So we're grateful for that. Daddy, what do shots do? Shots are given to keep you from getting sick. How do they help? Well, they, so a vaccine, they actually put in a little bit of the sickness into you so that your body can learn how to fight the sickness so that you will be able to resist it in case it comes. Hey, how are you? Oh. Good job, you're such a big boy. Is there a heart in there? It's going beep beep, beep beep, beep beep, beep beep. It's a great heart. Now can you breathe for me? <sighs> Gorgeous! Let's see if you can take it over here. <laughs> no potatoes! Say, ah! Oh wow. Now say, cheese! Beautiful teeth. Do you brush them every day? Morning and night? Good job. My favorite. Oh, oh. I got you! <laughs> Caleb, do your ears work? <laughs> Let's go check your eyes. And look straight ahead. Sir. How'd you do with the seeing test? Good. How you did. So after this, we're gonna go get ice cream. The mom said we could go get lunch if you want to. I want to. You wanna go get lunch? And I also get toys and a sticker and ice cream and lunch. Yeah, that's perfect. Time for shots. All right, buddy, give dad a hug. Face your head that way. Yeah. Dad, I want you to hold this arm right here. Okay. Like that. Yep. Okay. Wrap your other arm around him. Whatever. Alright, 
Then you take in a big deep breath. Just like for yoga. And let it out slow. Guess what? The first one's done. You did it, buddy. You did it. All right, now look the other way. Look this way. Give me a big hug. Remember last time you got shots, you were hiding under the chair. This time you're just doing this. What? You know, I'm so proud of you. All right, let's go get an ice cream cone. It actually kind of hurted, but I didn't want a chance to cry. You were very brave, buddy. I'm proud of you. Do you hear the rain out there? I'm excited to go in the rain. So a lot of times you'll hear the question of why God lets bad things happen to good people. And sometimes I think about getting shots for kids. Like as a dad, you don't want someone to come and stab your kid with something, but you're doing it for a reason. Like we want to keep you safe. We want to protect you. And I know that that's not always the case with God. Like sometimes bad things happen because of the bad choices people make. But I think sometimes bad things happen for a bigger purpose, for good things that a father wants for his children. Just like shots. Shots are terrific. Yay! <laughs> but they hurt sometimes. Did you cry when you got shots? I don't think so. It is spoons. My own French fries. I love getting one-on-one -on -one time with my kids. Like cherries. So your cherry dipped cone. So we decided to bust out this Christmas present and play with it again. All right, so I just beat Caleb six times in a row. Now it's Isaac's turn. You ready? To win 10 times it. Okay, Isaac's blue, I'm red. <laughs> Wait, we gotta do two out of three. Okay. Two out of three, okay. You're going down. Today is a big day for Isaac because he is finishing his math curriculum for the year. I am so stinking proud of him. He has worked so hard on this math all year long. How's it feel to be finishing it? What? <laughs> you can't hear me, can you? I asked, how does it feel to be finishing your curriculum today? Cool. Cool? I am on the last question of the year. The whole year? Yes. Go for it. You're done. Well, since we homeschool, I'm really proud of Isaac and he's done with math for the day, but I actually bought him the next level up book and he's gonna start on that tomorrow. No rest for the weary. Good night, Jayhouse out. So apparently the kids have a prank planned for Jeremy. Have you ever tried fried pickles? Yeah. 